Nepal is a nation that boasts of its richness of natural resources and natural heritage. In terms of geography, Nepal occupies about 0.01% of the total of the Earth's surface. Of world plants, Nepal possesses 2.2% of flowering and 3% of non-flowering plants. Nepal's Kanali region, located in the Midwestern Development region, is regarded as rich in important herbal plants, flora and fauna, and non-timber forest products, NTFPs. The Kanali region has an abundance of water resources and natural beauty. The region has the potential of economic growth if natural resources are utilised in a sustainable manner. Due to a challenging landscape, lack of infrastructure and access to markets, natural resources have not been sustainably exploited. Life in the Kanali region is hard, with high unemployment and destruction of the environment. Despite all this, Herb products continue to provide the chief form of livelihood. Uh, the residents of the region still remember the suffering of the past when they were collecting and selling herbs. Barkhari awa doi tin barsa boy jomla ma motor bato ai pogya cha. A paila ta chalisho barsa samma tapai ko. Ami le paytel marga gaira rupani. Ami le Nepal gan hundai Delhi samma pani bogi rupani. Ami le nayaka jodi boiti ka chaena. Awa pachas saiti kela ka bhari bogi rupani Delhi ko khari bauli. Tapai ko mlasar. Some much and a Bontari day, I'm in Yako Jordi Boti, I'm the Betim. Bazar Cos and Koji, I'm here, Bontari Rakasam. Also Yako Jordi Boti, Yakagoma, Gutichau, Sotua, Bonlason, the Star Jordi Boti, Jalla Polda Jane, Moliman Jordi Boti, Kodiko Bauma, Bidis Matik, China, Tapago, Indiama, Kodiko Bauma, Bigri by Rakas. The herbs produced in Kanali are exported to India, China, and European countries. As the farmers lack sufficient knowledge of collecting, storing, processing and diversifying the range of their herbal products, prices for their products remain weak. This <laughs> एकदमै राम्रोसँग बजार पाएको छैन तर थुप्रै कुराहरुको यहाँ जडीबुटी संकलन देखि लिएर बजारीकरण सम्मका समस्याहरु पर्याप्त मात्रामा देख्न पाइन्छ The Kanali region is regarded as a treasure trove of herbal plants. The need is there for the sustainable management of herb products. Such an action will raise living standards as well as contributing to the economy of the nation. Known as Atis Kanali, access to trade, inclusion and social justice for Kanali people, this project, supported by the European Union, covers the districts of Jumla, Umla and Mugu. The project is being implemented in collaboration with Mission East, ANSAB, Asia Network for Sustainable Agriculture and Bioresources, and Kanali Integrated Rural Development and Research Centre, Kirda.
The project has been implemented at local level through local non-government organisations. RDGP, the Rural Development Group Programme, Joomla, RCDC, Rural Community Development Centre, Mugu, and WWS, Women's Welfare Service, Humla. The project aims to help farmers find markets for herbal products by including local consumers and guaranteeing social justice. Training local people as entrepreneurs and creating employment opportunities through the sustainable management of herbal products. Major herbs such as datello, jatamashi and shungawal are abundantly available in Kanali. Different processing centres are involved in processing these herbs into aromatic oils which are exported to international markets. The project has provided the necessary skill-based training, technical and financial support for the local farmers, consumers and entrepreneurs for running their enterprises. The project has assisted in making markets more accessible for producers of non-timber-based forest products. Along with the increasing demand for herbs, the opportunities for green employment have risen. Socially backward women, Dalits, indigenous as well as physically disabled people have benefited from the project. This project has been able to get a lot of money and get a lot of money to 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 get a lot of संकलन गरेका वस्तुहरुको बजार मूल्यको विषयमा राम्ररी जानकारी गराएको छ त्यसर्थ बिचौलेहरुले स्थानीय उपभोक्ताहरुलाई धेरै ठग्न सकेका छैनन् Farmers and herb collectors have begun to get good returns from herb oil हामी के जुत फेरुला के अनि बच्चाहरुलाई बाल बच्चालाई पढाउँला काफी कलम गराउँला के हाम्रो तेल थोप खाउँला भनेर हामी महिला Didi bui ni oru, ami leg ma gora lo rodde pade amlo gobre sallu le unu baya sa. Kei amlo ortis kor nali le kei swagwat dinu baya sa. Kei ne kei aza ami rozgari kei dinu baya kat sa sa. Officially certified non-timber forest products always sell for higher prices. As a result, entrepreneurs have started getting certification for their products. यहाँ बाटा बोरा मा पटाऊं चु, उधर बाटा बोतल बाटा ले राऊं चु, त्यो जली बूटी हमले सोच के रखे कुछ हो कि यो बोतल मा जाऊँ, हमले बोरा मन्ना पटाये रा, बोतल मा पटाये पची राम रो हुन्चा, तेरा बोतल मा पटाऊं दा खिरी मा यो समस्या देरे था, आइले चम्मा चाइने कुने तिस्तो ये इसको नियम कानून बने कुछ ह किसान ले चाहिए रामरोस्ता खेती करोस किसान ले चाहिए रामरोस्ता जलीबुटी ले परसोधन करोस रामरोस्ता क्वालिटी बनाओस। In a span of 23 years, ANSAP has successfully implemented projects aimed at creating small-scale entrepreneurship opportunities in non-timber forest products for residents of the Kanali region. The Atis Kanali project placed special emphasis on research into high-value herbs, sustainable management, farming, processing, as well as certification and commercialization. I'm le yo aile tin barsa agi Kanali ma phiri yoda atis Kanali banana. Gari baru bipanna orlaise badi banda badi phaida dini kisimle. 
रहाँ को आर्थिक विस कर अब सब भाग बड़ी फायदा वहाँ पाने किसम कसरी जान सकता फेरिने यो वन में जड़ीबुटी में अरु खाल उद्यम करना सकता भाई किसिम के इस बनाए तो क्रम में अल्ले नया खाल कोई अब प्रडक्टर पर पैला का कुरायमित करते जस्तु अलग ढटे एकदम राम कि आक हमें अंतरराष्ट्रीय बजार में भी लग्य रामी जो उद्यम भी एटा अगुआ उद्यम नभकन राष्ट्रीय रूप में नभकन हमें बाहर लुर्यान रहा सब फायदा दिन भी सकिं तो करने क्रम में हमें इसको सीकाई तेल अगड़ी लिया The Kanali region possesses an abundance of herbs and non-timber forest products. Despite having limited resources and means at its disposal, the Atis Kanali project has yielded positive results, setting new examples for all stakeholders. If the herbs and non-timber forest products of the region are utilized wisely, then it will contribute to the development of the entire region. ANSAB has shown that stakeholders can strengthen their livelihoods by coordinating and cooperating and by applying entrepreneurship to the sustainable management of herbs and non-timber forest products. <laughs>